Jada Toys, the toy company has been taking the action figure world by storm. Tons of reviewers and influencers have been raving about this brand and more specifically their Street Fighter line. In today's video, we're going to see if Jada Toys is worth the hype by looking at one of their newest figures, the Street Fighter Chung Lee. Right away, I gotta say I love this packaging. The arcane design is very unique and makes this toy line stand out from the rest. On the back, we can see other characters and possible future figures. Jada, please make Blanca, I'm begging you. Anyway, let's get this figure out the package and see what it brings. After spending some time messing around with the figure, I gotta say, it's pretty good. Now, is it perfect? No, but it's still great. Now, this isn't your traditional review. I'm gonna highlight the good and talk about what needs to be improved. Let's start off with the accessories with this figure. We got a set of chopping hands and a screaming head sculpt. We can't forget about this great effect piece. What's cool about it is that the stand is articulated and the piece is hollow so you can actually put her feet in the effect. This is super awesome and definitely a standout from other figure accessories. But let's get back to the figure. I will say the overall scope and look of this figure is nice and looks straight out of the video game. Now it's been a long time since I played Street Fighter 2, so there might be some differences, but nothing major that I see. So, so far they passed that test. Time for the articulation of the figure. And let's say, <laughs> this is cinema. So at first I was worried looking at the bicep and I thought it won't move. But to my surprise, Jada Toys showed the creativity because we still have bicep swivel, but it's in the sleeve instead of outside the sleeve. That's pretty great and I like how they cared enough to make sure that was included. The next thing is the leg articulation. This needs to be great because Chung Li is known for her kicks and they passed that test too. They gave her her thick thighs and still was able to give her her full mobility and articulation. She can still do the splits, kick high up forward and to the side. I'm surprised they were able to achieve this with this sculpt. She can even balance a kick pose which pairs great with the effect she comes with. Now I gotta go over what needs to be improved, which isn't a lot by the way. For one, I gotta say there's some QC issues with the paint, but it isn't too bad so I'm not upset. The next issue is my calm head sculpt is a bit loose on the neck peg. Those are only minor issues and I'm sure it's just my copy and not an overall issue. In Conclusion, is Jada Toys worth the hype? Yeah, I will say so. For what you get with a $25 price point, I understand why everyone loves this line so far. We've got a good amount of accessories, accurate sculpt, and shocking articulation. I'm happy with what I see, and I hope Jada Toys has massive success. Go pick up some Street Fighter figures if you can. Comment down below what do you think of Jada Toys, and let's get this video to 50 likes, and I'll see you all in the next one.